It's no secret hand dryers are one of the least sanitary ways that you can dry your hands. There's no other way to look at it. Hand dryers, hot air dryers, jet air dryers, it doesn't matter. Paper towels will always be more sanitary and effective every single time. Studies have shown that air dryers require at least 60 seconds to adequately dry, whereas most people only use them for about 30 seconds on average. Why is this a problem? Well, bacteria thrives on wet hands. When people don't fully dry their hands, they're more prone to spreading bacteria. In fact, wet hands are capable of spreading a thousand times more bacteria than dry hands. But we can't fault air dryers just because people don't use them long enough. No, instead there are three great reasons to fault hair dryers. Let's talk about it. Reason number one, hand dryers blow bacteria onto your clean hands. This holds true regardless of the type of air dryer in question. It's because air dryers suck in air from the bathroom and use that same air to dry your hands. Fun fact, did you know that every time an uncovered toilet flushes, it sends fecal matter that can disperse across 60 square feet? If the hand dryer you use is within that area, it's using that air. Tons of studies have proved that after using an air dryer, bacteria count on hands rises. Standard air dryers increase the germ count on fingertips by up to 42% compared to paper towels. As for hot air dryers, that figure rises to 194%. The second reason, hand dryers, dry your, hand dryers dry your hands by sending water and bacteria into the air. When you use paper towels, water is absorbed from your hands, leaving them almost completely dry. Using a paper towel for just 10 seconds will remove up to 90% of the moisture while decreasing the amount of germs by up to 77%. Air dryers, on the other hand, don't remove moisture so much as they blow the moisture from your hands into the air and on surrounding surfaces. One study found that after using a jet dryer, the average surface contamination following hand contact was over 10 times higher than if paper towels had been used. And if that wasn't scary enough for you, Another study found that air dryer surfaces have contamination levels 75 times higher than the average toilet seat. So while they're spewing bacteria onto your hands, they're also putting it into the air and on any surface that air touches, promoting cross-contamination and the spread of germs. Reason number three, no-touch hand dryers lie to you. No-touch hand dryers are advertised as a solution to cross-contamination. The idea is that a bathroom surface has a high bacteria count, so the air dryer is protecting you by not requiring you to touch it. While yes, you don't have to touch the air dryer, we know from reason number one that air dryers are spewing bacteria onto your hands regardless of whether you touch the device or not. No touch paper towel dispensers, however, are genuinely no touch applications. Paper towels are able to effectively combat the spread of germs precisely because they're so effective at removing moisture and bacteria from your hands. Even the physical act of rubbing your hands with a paper towel alone removes bacteria and moisture, unlike an air dryer. At Imperial Dade, we offer a full line of hand hygiene products, including innovative paper towel dispensing systems, hand soaps, and sanitizers. Please reach out to a local wrap near you and take advantage of our unparalleled services, training and products to help keep you and your restrooms clean and safe. Thanks so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below.